Anthony Tomlinson? Yeah. How are we? I'm good, thank you. How are you? Yeah, not bad, thanks. Fos for seconds out, by the way. Just get the intro in there. Um, when are we out next? Uh, September 21st, I'm out next, uh, fighting for the IBO Intercontinental title. Uh, I think it's a great fight for me. Just coming from my victory, defending my Central Area World Way title. I just, be I just believe that it's a good step for me in my career. I think my manager's got his right interest in heart, and I think we're going down the right route and right direction for my career, yeah. At what point do you believe it'll be time to get rid of that Central Area and push on? Is, the, is now the time? No, it's definitely the time because I won the Central Area against um, an undefeated fighter. Um, I knocked him out devastatingly. Um, I defended my title against another undefeated fighter and I won by stoppage again. So, um, yeah, at Central, Central Area like, level, I've, I've proven myself beyond that now. So, yeah, um, we're quite happy to vacate that title now, yeah. And once you, once you fight for this Fringe IBO title yeah. on... So on September the 21st, where, where do we want to go from there? You'd, you'd love for me manager to push me on to a world, world title, you know what I mean? But like I said, not, not, not going above myself, you know what I mean? Like, I'll prove myself, keep going up, like little steps at a time, you know what I mean? So, I know for a fact I'm going to win this IBO Intercontinental World title, definitely, uh, I mean, uh, international title, sorry. Um, it's just small steps for me. I, ain't had a, I didn't have a massive amateur career, 15 fights. I'm 10 fights in with five knockouts now as a professional. Just baby steps, experience. Um, but if opportunity is there with anybody in World Weight Division, they know for the fact that I'll turn up and fight, yeah. Is that the only thing that you feel you lack in, the, in that welterweight division experience at the moment? I don't know, because I've been in with some good kids already, you know what I mean? I've beat kids that I've been in gym from uh, 12 years of age, so... I think it's proving that my style and my presence in ring and my powers beating these kids with the experience over me. So um, I do, I, yeah, I don't, I don't think I'm, I'm like I need any more experience. Really, I just, I just need small fights. And like you say, I do, I need more ring time. Yeah, because like you say, I'm fighting these kids and I shouldn't be stopping them, and I'm stopping them. So I'm not going full distance. <laughs> That's what it is. Um, but like I said, not getting above myself, really. Um, bring it back down. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm happy to fight anybody, mate. You know what I mean? I mean, I'm in the fighting game to fight, and I won't, I won't avoid any fight now. And would you like, just finally, would you like to get out again before the end of the year after September? Um, more than definitely. If the fight's there, I'll, I'll be out. Like, if we get a phone call, if my manager puts another show on, like we're there, so like a main event, like you say, on September 21st, but I will definitely get out before end of the year, yeah. Definitely. And I've been asked to ask you by Dave Allen, who's your hero? David Allen. <laughs> that was the right answer. <laughs> Cheers, Dave. <laughs> Thanks, Anthony. Cheers, mate.